save non-league to top league um it's gonna be a bit of a short episode today because my computer messed up um as in the last episode where i mentioned it crashed this time it it's been very slow and i know i hit the record button but it's saying i didn't hit the record button so we did miss the whole episode of me recording it so i'm just going to do a quick just a quick brief over of the games show you the highlights um, and then that do for this episode. So I do really apologise. It's going to be very short and sweet. So I see you at the start of the Norwich game. Hello. Um, as you can see, we lost Norwich one nil. Um, bit of an even game, but they probably did edge it overall with possession and xG and performance wise of their players. Um, let's just watch the goal. Um, yeah, I just think we did perform massively well. Seems we were on such a good run of form uh, previously to this. I'll show you that because, of course, you would have missed that. So let's just watch the goal here building up. It's a nice little through ball here. I thought Phillips got the tackle, but he just misses. Um, and Gabriel Saar puts that away. Um, yeah, so not a bad performance overall. Passing was okay our possession wasn't but then they are the home team it is Norwich I expect them to be a lot better than us um, but yeah overall a bit disappointed but I f understand the result there so the next game was the QPR game so I'll show you the little stats of that and also I'll show you our form in between hi there welcome back uh, this is a QPR game better result here a 2-0 win was a wicked uh, own goal but as you can see from the stats, we absolutely peppered them, destroyed them. I did need to think we were taking too many long shots, but again, our passing rate was better. Possession was incredible. Four XG, and we only got two goals because of Begovic. He was absolutely on fire, just saving everything. I said and we were lucky to get that own goal. It was a wicked deflection off their player. Uh, we'll get to see that in the goals. So let's have a little look at the two goals that were scored. Uh, so there's the first goal coming up. Great little play between on the left-hand side. Lovely shot, hits the post, and being a little poacher is there with Miles. And then this is the deflection, which we'll get to see. It's a decent ball in. Um, it just, I don't know if Canu miscites him, but it's a wicked deflection off of him and into the goal. Um, and a great 2 0 win for us there. Let's have a little look back then um, at what's happened before that. So, after the um, Mansfield game, where we had a great 5 0 win, we did lose to Sunderland. They edged the game. And I think it didn't help that uh, Maynard had such a bad game in goal. This was a little bit frustrating. It was away from home. Um, and as you can see, we didn't play very well here, but they didn't play very well at all. It had, they had a massive deflected shot off of one of these was a deflected shot. Um, and it was about even, so a draw probably would have been fair there, but we did lose. Uh, we then did pick up the Oxford win, a Bristol City win. We did beat Accrington in the Carabao Cup, which puts us through to the next round where we were playing Middlesbrough. Uh, and then we did get a good win over Watford away from home as well. A couple of friendlies just to keep that momentum going, um, which didn't quite help against Norwich, but it definitely helped us against QPR. Um, next game will definitely include, next episode will definitely include Millwall. I um, haven't decided if I'm going to play Wednesday or Hull in that. But yes, that's what will be included in the next episode because that's one of our fierce rivalries for you. But. Um, that's it, very short episode because of the recording error. Um, so sorry about that, but as always, thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll catch you again soon.